Hello and welcome to our channel. This bee caters to professional graphic designers and those with no design skills or experience. Even non-designers can use it to create visuals that they can be proud of. You can create branded charts and graphs to add to data-driven articles. In this video, we will tell you everything you need to know about this graphic design tool, including its features. Visme is not your ordinary design tool. It is an intuitive and powerful content design tool combined with robust file storage like Google Drive and a collaboration tool in one place. So not only can you create beautiful branded content, but you can store the design and all the assets and content you add to design so you can access them at any time in the future and resume them in other methods. Visme has hundreds of templates for data visualization and infographics including 30 plus data widgets, 30 plus charts and graphs, maps for every country in the world and hundreds of infographic blocks. You can use static data, plug in dynamic data and Visme will show all the changes in real time. In Visme, you can upload your projects depending on the type of the project in PDF, PNG, JPEG, MP4, HTML5, GIF formats or publish to the web with data analytics. Visme measures your public project traffic. Visme determines where the user came from when viewing a public project including their country, IP address, length of time consumed considering the project and success rate if applicable. You can create standalone presentations and audio tutorials by adding voice to your Visma presentation. You can choose from dozens of free audio clips of different genres and mods, but you can also upload your audio files. These clips can be attached to one specific slide or set up background music for the entire presentation. Audio recording is also possible. Each audio can be edited for each slide. You can trim the clip, add fades, adjust the volume and loop the sound. Thanks to the voiceover feature, you can transform any written content in a Visme slideshow with a commentary. You can share and invite others to view or comment on your work and ask team members into your workspace to collaborate and edit. Register for Visme, then log in to create an account and start working. There's a several account options such as free. The functionality of each option is different. After registration, you will receive a window to choose the preferred option to use the service. The choice does not play a significant role, but the system will try to personalize the workflow into the essential direction. There may be additional windows for settings, but in the end, the Visme site will prompt you to get started. After clicking on the Continue button, you will get to the window for selecting a template for creating content. The available sections are Presentations, Infographics, Documents, Charts and Graphs, Printed Editions, Web Graphics, Graphics for Social Networks, Video, Other, Arbitrary Size. Let's select Presentations, where you'll see a list of presentation categories, among which are Business, Creative, education, finance, and many others. Let's select education, for example. You will see a list of presentation templates of the education category. When you hover your mouse over the template you're interested in, you will see two links. Preview, which opens the presentation templates into demonstration mode so you can see all the features of the template. Edit, a link to edit the template. If you click the Use this template button on the preview page or the Edit button on the template section page, a window opens for creating a presentation using the selected template. Template. In the center of the screen is the slide we're going to work on. To edit any element on the decline, just click on it with the left mouse button. For example, by clicking on the header, we get access to editing the header text, its size, font, and so on. You can also work with any object on the slide. Click on it, accessing editing tools. To work with slides, click New Slide on the right side of the workspace. A window opens where you can choose a template for the next slide. The templates in Visme are designed with business users in mind. They look elegant and professional. However, Visme users can go farther and create their own branded templates. Our artificial intelligent feature take branding from a website or logo and, in less than two minutes, makes a set of templates that represent your branding. There are three categories of templates to choose from. Theme slide – choose a slide template from your current design theme or a blank slide. My library – select a slide template from your slide library, but the library is available with a premium subscription. More templates – select a template from another design theme. We get access to a structured database of design templates in this category. You can search for the suitable template by keyword or move through the types of templates by clicking the left mouse button in search of the desired option. Stop at the first category, Theme Slide, and select one offered slide. Move on mouse pointer to the fall. When the Insert button appears, click on the decline. You'll get a new drop-in in the working area and manipulate it to get the desired view. The left panel of the workspace contains robust functionality for creating content on slides. 
the functionality is grouped into sections. The basic section focuses on tools such as header and text, where you can change the title and text. Under font pairs, you can see predefined pairs or fonts to choose any one you like best. The graphics and text tool allows you to select information block that combine text and graphics. Visme provides more than 50 diagrams and data widgets. Whether you want to visualize simple statistics and number or visualize large data sets, you can create and fully customize your data in easy to understand data visualizations. There are also tools like PhotoGrade, Call to Action, and My Block for creating arbitrary blocks. With the help of the graphics section, you can place blank for creating simple graphical objects, lines, two and three three-dimensional shapes and icons. There's also more complex process for creating illustrations, characters, gestures and special effects. You can also take a look at the section with photos. There are stock photos, GIFs and maps, but also some of the content is available with a premium subscription. The data section focuses on visualizing data and its relations, graphs, charts, tables, and maps. Pay special attention to the spectacular data widget tool, which allows you to create visual objects based on randomly entered data automatically. For example, select the desired widget and set its data and design, and the device generates an appropriate visual image. The media section contains fools of interesting video files, use sound files, or from the built-in library. In this section, you can also embed media from external sources. YouTube, Vimeo, Wistia, Vidyard, Loom. There's a tool for recording audio accompaniment, but this tool and some others are only available with a premium subscription. You can upload your files to the Moist Files category. The library allows you to store up to 100 megabytes files in a free account. Visme templates are great. There are thousands of options and they're fully customizable for everything you need to create and communicate. But what's even better is having a series of templates with your branded fonts, colors, and logo ready to go in minutes. Once you've logged into your control panel, you'll see a sidebar with several tabs on the left side of the platform. Click on My Brand to access the brand area. The upper right corner of the brand area, you will see a Brand Wizard button. This will open the Brand Wizard page where you will need to enter or copy or paste your business website URL, which Visme will use to pull your brand's assets into the branded area automatically. Then click Go To. Once your brand assets are extracted, select the logo you want to add to Visme by clicking on the correct image for your brand and move forward by clicking Next. Then select which fonts you want to add to Visme by clicking the Add the Visme button. You can choose one or more of them. To move forward, click the Next button. Now it's time to customize your brand color palette by choosing the right color by clicking the Add to Visme button. You can select one or more of them. To move forward, click on the Next button. The last step is to choose the design style you like best for your brand. Once you've selected a class, click the Next button. Once that's done, all of your brand assets will be extracted and you'll have to amplify ready to use right away. Now all you have to do is click Go to My Brand Templates to access beautiful templates in over 30 content formats that reflect your brand. Hover your mouse over the template for the type of format you want to create and click Edit to start editing that project in the editor. Visme is one of the best infographic tools on the market today. It is intuitive and designed with many free templates, editor, and data analysis features that simplify the graphic design. Thank you a lot for watching this video. Check out the channel for other videos.